welcome back. We're about to head into this cave thing behind the waterfall. So let's do it. You're not a mouse? What kind of foul creature are you? I'll leash you just like I did those stupid lake elementals. Oh man, he's light. Oh boy. Um, I'm gonna have to be right back. <laughs> Alright, let's go in. And yes, I know they're myth, these guys. Um, mobs. I just... Um, put one on there. Since that third guy has three power pips, I don't think I'll cast a blade just yet, just in case the earthquakes. Ouch, that hurt. Not. <laughs> yep, I thought you would have hurt. But that's uh I called it. <laughs> and it just have the death trap activate when, it, when it's ready and the spell's ready but I'm still a bit bummed about those uh about that gnome hitting me and squishing my accuracy <clears throat> So, um, I think I'll fake a heal. Because I'll take one of those off. Hopefully my pet will take care of the other one. Because I do want to heal. Eventually. Because that, you know, this battle isn't going too well. Right now. But I'm not giving up. Oh, great. Now I get a potent trap. <laughs> Alright. Um... Okay, so... Uh... Yeah. It's not gonna cast, so why not? <sighs> I don't have to worry about Earthquake if I do this, because it's just gonna fizzle. <laughs> Didn't hurt. Um, 
another one? <laughs> another Minotaur. Well, I certainly need healing now. Um, I can take care of this first. And heal. Too bad. Owie! That hurt my pinky! <laughs> um, so I got another potent trap and another colossal, like I need that. Um, so another low on pips, the module low on pips. So, I think I'm gonna start with some blades. Since I got plenty of pips right now. I hope I find the prisms because I put prisms in. I put a few. Um. Oh yeah, <laughs> this one I've seen plenty of in this in this world. Goat monk. Yep, yep, yep. Ooh, that on it too. Well, I'm not doing too well, okay? I'm not doing too good right now, am I? Oh, that helps. Um, should I heal or should I attack? Or should I keep laying? Ooh, yeah, I'm gonna attack. I'm not gonna waste the turn because he's um, the third guy almost has six pips. And next turn he will have six pips if he doesn't use them this turn. So gotta watch out for that. Definitely don't want to be earthquake with all those blades on me. Did he die? Yes, he died. Yeah, he's not gonna die. I knew that. But I just want the mobs out of the way. <laughs> so I can blade in safety. <laughs> Relative safety. <laughs> Another life trap. How lovely. Not gonna put this on this, even though I'd rather use it on the other thing. Uh yeah. Gonna heal. Whoop! Fizzle. That's not supposed to happen. You're supposed to know where you're aiming. <laughs> Alright. So before I cast this, I need help. Okay. Um, well that's good if he puts a thing on me. Um, well, there's not much else I can do right now. <laughs> get hurt too bad this round. Oh man. Well. Oh man. Come on. No way. Are you insane? Are you insane, Becky? Oh man. Okay, I'm gonna cast this. I'm running out of time. <laughs> Oh, 
Ouch. That was an official ouch. Yep, yep. Ooh. This could help. That should help. <laughs> pretty, pretty well. Here's open. I hope I get the... Um... um no. I'm going to wait. Well, I have more of these. I have more of these, I think. So... Eh. I'm scared. I'm scared and he's got a lot of pips. Sort of. <laughs> Alright, so I healed. Um, not doing too bad anymore. Oh yeah. Yeah, protect yourself. You know to protect yourself now. Um... I already got that. Uh, I'm gonna wait on that. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, eh. Okay, I'll do this. I'll be fine. I hope. I hope I'll be fine. He's got his own trap on me. Well, at least it's not gnomes or something. <laughs> that wouldn't be good. Or, uh... What's the other one? Spiny sword. <laughs> oh! My pet's healing me. Thank you! Good girl. Very good girl. Wonderful. And I got this, which I shall cast. We wish to get rid of the other um, faint. But I'll do that next round. go ahead and do that. You won't have a chance to heal. Um, this one goes on that. Yep. I'm okay. I'll be fine. I just need a prism. Can I get a prism here? Please? Can I please get a prism? I was gonna say as a mental note, the only blade I need is the 40 life blade, but I have a, um, um, alright, don't need this, I have a pet blade, and I think, oh that's right, I have a hex from my amulet that I haven't cast yet, don't need this, I don't think... If only I had that prism! Oh my gosh! Um... Yeah. I'll cast this. There we go. Oh boy. Yep. <laughs> I don't want a gnome thing there again. Hopefully it takes away his picks. Yeah! Goodbye, Pips. Okay. 
Um, don't need this. Probably won't need this, but I'll save it. Um, this should be good. If I could just find that prism. I put a few of them in there. What the heck? Well, I want to need three of these. Just the two. Okay, um... I'm just gonna do this because... How long do I want to wait? Seriously. <laughs> and with all those faints and the hex and everything, we probably won't even need... Nope, don't need this. Oh boy, now I get the potent trap. <laughs> okay. Um... Well, I'm... I'll save that. Um... Alright. I'll just set up to hit without the prisms, because this is taking too long. Fifteen minutes and a half already. I said that wrong. <laughs> Whatever. Oh man. Gnomes, I didn't prevent it. No! No, not gnomes. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so should I do this since it's gonna fizzle anyway? Um, yeah. Oh, look what I got. Um. I'm gonna do this little fizzle. Cause I wanna save all my other spells. Oh my gosh, now I get it. Ugh. Now I get the thing. Now I can kill without it. I hope. I hope. Because that will be... oh my goodness. Um... Nope. Nope. Oh, I should have kept that in case I fizzled or something. Um... Alright. Am I ready? I hope so. If not, at least I'll heal. Right? Because the spell is a heal spell too. So that's useful. I didn't find my, pl my pet uh, blade. But here you go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. <sighs> I surrender. I release the curse that held the lake elementals in my thrall. Sweet. Look what we did, folks. Look what we did, young wizards. If this would load. I was like, gonna be... Oh. Okay. I'll talk to them. Smellbinder, thank you for freeing us. We will leave the burrowers in peace. Thank you. <laughs> Wonderful. Look at that. And I can go down here? Good. That's cool. Alright, so let's talk to Elazar Fireblade and tell him that the way is clear. Uh, 
where is he? Over here? He is... Over here. Good. Oh, hello somebody else. Falcor Ring Whisperer. Well done, Spellbinder! Thank you for removing this great obstacle for us! We must re-establish communications post-haste! Absolutely. The path is opened again to Queen Myrtle Town. Can you take a message for me to the Air Force Commander to buy a split sky? Sounds alright. I'll do that. It's imperative that the message gets to him, and I cannot trust that my men won't be intercepted by the Umbra Legion. You can't trust them, but you can trust me. Okay. I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> Wait, am I? Wait a minute. I need another wisp, even though it doesn't look like it, because I do want to be in the best of health when I continue my quest. Because that fight took a lot out of me, as you could tell. <laughs> Either two wisps to recover. Alrighty. Let's go. I wonder what's over here. Oh well. Wonder if I'll find out someday. <laughs> you bear a message from Elazar Fireblade? Yep, I do. <laughs> Who are you that we should trust this message? Sabra says she knows you. Is this true? Yep. Uh okay. This is the spellbinder who freed Florian and me from the apiary and who helped Jalen in Bumblertown. This spellbinder is good and powerful and could be a useful ally. Thank you. I see. Hm. Huh. It takes a great deal to convince Sabra, so that is high praise indeed. We know that Shadow Weavers and Yellow Jackets have been massing in Camp Havoc, just beyond our borders. They are going to retaliate for our attack on the Apidae village. The Spellbinder could infiltrate Camp Havoc to learn their plans. You can sneak into Havoc via our hidden portal that leads directly into their camp. They know nothing of it, so you will have surprise. It's a strong idea. Force the Night Flames to reveal their leader to you. He'll have the information we need. All right. I think I'm gonna have to do this in the book. Or I'll go there first, and then I'll do this in the next episode. Alrighty. Ooh, I see a wooden chest. And I got... Well, there. I found it. <laughs> Alright. Oh, 90 gold? Are you kidding me? I'm in chrysalis. I shouldn't be getting 90 gold. I should be getting 190 gold. <laughs> anyway. Um, I will see you in the next episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe and leave a comment to say hi or whatever you want to say. And I will see you soon. Bye.